Hello everybody, this is Dr. Domelza with a sneak peek for some animal art that will be available at our animal art show in September. So today I'm going to show you animal art that's been done by many of our smaller animals, most of whom reside in Biodiversity Hall. Now for the most part, they would put newspaper down with some paint on it and then canvas. The animal walks around the area and as they walk across the paint, they transfer it onto the canvas. So I'll discuss each one in turn. So the large one in the back is by a fennec fox, as is this contribution here from Pika and Jelani. This piece is by Harvey the armadillo, and you can see his tail imprint as he has gone over that piece. This piece back here is by our lorikeet flock. And then another contribution from a bird. This one is by Rocky, our umbrella cockatoo. Now down for some tiny little critters. This one here is by our Chilean Daegu, Vente and Grande. And then we have a contribution from Clarabelle, our hedgehog. Back here, we have a contribution from Lucy and Hugo, the New Guinea singing dogs. And then over here is one by Charles, our African crested porcupine. Now these two here on the left and the right, these are by our meerkat boys. And then finally over here, this is a contribution from Rosie, our binturong. Now she lives in the primate area, but I've included her in this section. So this is from Rosie the Binturong. Now we use non-toxic tempera paint and it's the animal's choice to participate in the activity. We have more than this available. So we have artwork from all kinds of species, from very small species, such as our hedgehog and our dago, all the way up to our largest species, such as the giraffe. So join us in September for our animal art show.